Yo, welcome to another Tommy's unboxing. Uh, I'm gonna do another Elite. As you saw last time, I unboxed this piece of shit. Uh, the Santino. Um, at first I thought it was pretty good, until I realized the only fucking bonus it has was this piece of shit Cobra or something, and it's like, seriously? Five cents of, of fiber? And it doesn't even look like him. Uh, uh, comparing it to, to the Walmart uh, Superstar Entrance exclusive, that is a much better likeness. And, and this was much cheaper, and it has a shirt that I bought on WWE Shop so I can dress like him. Uh, overall, you know, piece of shit. Piece of shit. Uh, I do not recommend it. But today, we are going to unbox... JBL. I'm just fucking kidding. <laughs> I'm not gonna do that. Uh, who cares about Series 23? I'm gonna do that next time. This time is Series 24, Dolph Ziggler, the relative resident dolphin for the WWE. So, because we're... Oh my god, where's my fucking knife? These things are so stupid. What the fuck? Okay, I got my knife. Hopefully, because this is a, uh, a Series 24, they'll make it a little bit easier to open, because honestly, they're the biggest pieces of shit when it comes to opening. Fucking assholes. Okay, so here's, here's my main problem. Look at this. Look at this. It's double. Doubled up. So it's like, I fucking take off one... And then I gotta take off the rest, and I'm gonna fucking rip it in one of these days. Okay, now I think it's open. Now I think I can finally get it out. And there, fuck that. Fuck it. Uh, we got Dolph. With his shirt. Um, I know a lot of you have been uh, letting me know that you really like my uh, wax suggestion, and I know that there is a subculture of people that do this with their toys. I can say that they forgot to fix the doll figure, it seems, and you can make a wax impression of his back if you take it out carefully, so I'm going to see how carefully you can take this. Oh my god. Okay, he's out. And I'm going to stand him up there, and next I'm going to take off his, his belt. As you can see right there, it says World Heavyweight Wrestling Champion. It's, um, cheap fucking plastic. I thought it was going to be legitimate leather. What the fuck? This was fucking $20, and it doesn't even come with a leather belt. Seriously. Fuck this. Okay, I'm just going to... And this is Dolph, and... Oh, fuck. Okay, I gotta get him to stand. As you can see, he's so happy. He's so happy that I spent my well-earned money on this piece of shit figure. It's, uh, his butt says my time. I don't know what that means, so I'm gonna put his belt on. Okay, it's on. There he is with his belt. Let's, uh, he's, um can't really move his arms. Arms up in the air. Oh, there. There we go. Okay, and then, uh, as you can see, he's really heavy. He got his belt on. Yay, yay. So let's, let's give him his shirt. Oh, they make these things so difficult to put on. Okay, now here he is, complete. This is the Dolph Ziggler Elite. Um, you know, I'm kind of disappointed by the shirt. Uh, it doesn't cover his whole body, but obviously, choosers can't be complainers. Um, I wish they made it out of fabric or something, or like, I'm, I'm not quite sure this is the best way to do a shirt, because it's not covering his back, and it looks, he just looks really stupid, who wears a shirt like this, but overall, it's Dolph Ziggler, he's the show-off. Um, he can do whatever he wants, you know, seriously. And let's see how easy it is for him to stand with his shirt on and his belt on. 
not very easily so I'm gonna have to put them in a weird ass position and don't fall down dude there he is standing and uh, overall I'd, I'd rate this figure not the greatest not as as beautiful as as my first one. Oh shit! Oh shit!